When you imagine an alien, you probably think of something with big eyes, weird limbs, and a brain that works nothing like ours. Now, think about the octopus. It has three hearts, blue blood, it can change color and texture in an instant. Its arms can move, taste, and solve problems independently. And it can squeeze through a hole the size of a coin. So it's no wonder scientists only half-jokingly have said octopuses might as well be aliens. Let's break down why. Octopuses are part of a group called cephalopods, which includes squid, cuttlefish, and nautiluses. They've been around for over 500 million years, evolving long before the dinosaurs and surviving multiple mass extinctions. But it's their intelligence that truly sets them apart. Despite having no backbone, octopuses are capable of astonishing behavior. They can solve mazes, use tools, recognize individual humans by face and touch. They've short-circuited lights, escaped sealed aquariums, and even climbed out of tanks to steal food from neighboring tanks. But here's the twist. Most of their neurons aren't even in their brain. More than two-thirds of an octopus's neurons are in its arms. Each arm can operate semi-independently, exploring, reacting, even making decisions, all without direction from the central brain. It's like having eight mini-brains on call at all times. Then there's their camouflage. Octopuses don't just change color. They can shift texture and shape to blend perfectly into coral, rock, or sand in less than a second. What's even stranger, they're colorblind. They manipulate color perfectly without seeing it the way that we do. How? We're still not totally sure. When scientists sequenced the octopus genome in 2015, it got even weirder. They found over 33,000 protein-coding genes, more than humans. Genes for things like neural development and camouflage appeared in unusual patterns, including some genes not seen anywhere else in the animal kingdom. Octopuses can even edit their own RNA, meaning they can reprogram how their genes are expressed, almost in real time, allowing them to adapt more rapidly than typical evolution would allow. It's no wonder a few fringe scientists propose the theory that octopuses may have arrived on Earth via a comet as frozen eggs from another world. That idea, called panspermia, is not widely accepted, but it reflects just how fundamentally strange these creatures are. Still, let's bring it back to reality. Octopuses aren't aliens, they evolved here, on Earth, just like we did. But what makes them feel so otherworldly is that they followed a radically different evolutionary path. Their intelligence didn't evolve for social bonding like ours. It evolved for survival in an ever-changing, often hostile environment one where camouflage, creativity, and problem solving became critical. And that's what makes the octopus not just fascinating, but important. Because right now, their ecosystems are under threat. Overfishing, warming oceans, pollution, and growing interest in octopus farming are all raising red flags. For a creature this intelligent, this sensitive, captivity may be more than just uncomfortable, it may be cruel. We still know so little about them. But maybe the more we understand the octopus, the more we'll realize just how much intelligence and mystery exist in life that looks nothing like us. The octopus is not an alien. It's something even more remarkable. A reminder that Earth has always been full of the strange, the brilliant, and the unexplained, if we care enough to look. This is Forever Green. If you love stories that make you rethink the natural world, subscribe and join our exclusive YouTube community for early access deeper dives and conversations that matter.